What's up everybody? Welcome to another honest review video. Today I have something different. Usually I don't do review videos of Kickstarter campaigns because it's very difficult to judge whether those products are really very good or not. So when Kefaya have contacted me, they wanted me to check their Kickstarter product. I was like, no, I don't want to do that. But they were persistent and well, I took a little while and tried a very amazing product. Today I have this modular Kefaya Q2 splitter. This one will actually help people to turn their laptop into a workstation. Okay, this one is totally built with aluminum magnesium material and yeah, definitely this one has very good sturdy build quality. But it's not that heavy, this one only weighs 1.82 kilograms. Okay, this one comes with two 10.1 inch FHD plus display panel. Both of the display panels are IPS LCD panels, but color rendition of these display panels are really amazing. It's above and beyond my expectations. Well, let me show you where are the display panels and why this one is modular. It's very easy to use. There are two stands on both the sides and actually the display panels are hidden inside. Okay, here comes one display panel. And here is another. There are two display panels and we can put the display panels on the stand. We can use the display panels on this modular stand or we can just separately use the display panels if we want. Both of the display panels comes with a stand at the back. So yeah, we can put the display panels on any flat surface using its stand. So both of these can be used independently or we can use this together on the stand or we can even use these together on any flat surface. Well, these are actually portable monitors. We can use these portable monitors without any worry because these portable monitors are built with care, built with precision and built with premium materials. I have tried many other Kickstarter products, I mean portable monitors and I've never been so very satisfied like this one. You can clearly see that Kefaya has used metal at the back and the other parts are polycarbonate. These are very good quality polycarbonate. It may seem like they have added some design language. Yeah, these are not only design language, but they have used every curve, every cutout to make this product as much perfect as possible. In hand, these portable monitors feel so very light yet so very premium. But nobody would buy a portable monitor because it has sturdy build quality or it feels so very premium, right? The most important part of a portable monitor is its display panel. Well, I have already mentioned earlier that these portable monitors comes with a IPS LCD panel, 10.1 inch IPS LCD panel, but the IPS LCD panels of these portable monitors are really comparable to any premium OLED panels. These are FHD panels and supports 1080p resolution. Usually we can go up to 1920 by 1080 so there isn't no problem with resolution and pixel per inch density is also very good. There is another thing. What about the brightness? Yeah, I've tried this in this studio. There are many studio lights over here. This studio goes very bright and even inside this studio, this one has performed. I have never felt like I cannot read or it's too dark. This one goes very bright, as bright as we need to use these in a working environment. Well, when we put the portable monitors on their stand, on this modular stand, we can get 360 degree horizontal and 180 degree vertical rotation. So yeah, field of view isn't an issue. We can use these portable monitors in any angle that we want. Well, both the portable monitors actually comes inside a metal shell or metal protective case. And we can extend the protective case to use up to a 17 inch laptop on this one. Okay, you can clearly see that this one is built with metal and the stands are actually connected to this shell with a very good hinge. Actually, there are two hinges on both sides. So there are four hinges and all the hinges are really, really very sturdy. Yeah, we need to use a bit of a force to rotate it. But that was required to make sure this product has a sturdy build quality. I have been using this one with my laptop, Windows 11 based laptop, but we can also use this one with MacBook without any issue.
Well, before we talk about how the portable monitors actually stays inside this metal shell, let me tell you another thing. Using any laptop on this protective case of the portable monitors actually make things a bit better because these aluminum panels actually works as a heat sink and yeah, this one helps to dissipate heat faster than any other material. We not only can extend this modular stand sideways, but Kefaya has added two little stands to extend this modular stand vertically. So that's really a great thing. At the bottom of this modular stand, there are four rubber grommets or rubber pads, which helps to get this modular stand better grip on any flat surface. Yeah, I have already mentioned earlier that there are some rubber silica gel pads on top of this modular stand that not only helps to protect any laptop or any other devices from any scratch, but that also helps laptops to get a better grip on this modular stand. Let me show you how the portable monitors actually stays inside this protective case or protective shell. This one is actually a double layer design. Yeah, from the left side, we can put one portable monitor. There is a very nice cutout. And yeah, this spring-loaded mechanism makes it very easy. When it's locked inside, there is a very nice clicky feelings. Yeah, that really gives a super satisfying clicky feelings. And when it's inside and locked, the portable monitors won't come out. One goes inside from the left and another goes inside from the right. The left one stays at the bottom and the right one stays on top. Yeah, one more time, this is a double layer design. And definitely this double layer design makes things easy because it helps us to carry both the portable monitors and the modular stand at the same time without worrying where to put the portable monitors. Well. Finally, let's talk about a few other things. Inside the box, you will get two HDMI cables. The cables are really very good quality cables. You will also get two USB-C to USB-C 3.1 cables, which is very helpful because we can use USB-C ports to get video output. When we are gonna use the USB-C ports, we will also be able to recharge our laptop through the port. So that's really a very nice thing. We don't need to use too many cables and clutter our desktop. But if you are gonna use HDMI cables, then yeah, you will need to add two other USB-C cables to power the portable monitors. As this one supports USB-C connectivity, it doesn't require us to install any drivers or anything, it's plug and play. It doesn't matter whether we are gonna get the video output through a USB-C cable or HDMI cable, we don't need any drivers, period. Yeah, that's all about this Kefaya portable monitors with a modular stand and I believe these offers the best value for money at this moment. Only 159 US dollars. Just go ahead, try by yourself, search online. Only 159 US dollars? Wow, that's really a very cheap price tag. Full disclosure, I have been using this product for almost a month now and the product was provided to me by Kefaya, but yeah, they didn't have any editorial input to this. You know, I always do honest review videos. So yeah, if you're looking for a set of portable monitors or if you wanna convert your laptop into a workstation, or maybe you need more display real estate for anything that you are doing on your laptop, you can go for this Kefaya Q2. Not only laptops, this one also supports tablets, which comes with a HDMI port or supports video output through USB-C port. If you have any question about this product, please don't forget to make a comment and let me know in the comment section below. I also have left a link of the Kickstarter campaign in the description box below. Go ahead, check that because there are some early bird pricing and gifts happening, so maybe you'll be able to grab something nice. If you have liked this video, then please don't forget to click on the like button. If you have loved this video, if you want to watch more videos like this, then please subscribe to this channel, support honest content. 